Yes, people, we're here. We're live and direct on the Big Bad Station, ArabacRadio.com. And we've got two great artists joining us today. We've got the great sounds of Queen Atara and we've got Berry Vodka. And, of course, they're going to come out and they're going to tell us some great vibes and energy that they've been coming with. So, of course, Atara, you go first and then Berry Vodka, you go next. Tell the listeners a little bit about yourself. Hey, UK. Hey, one more time. This is my third time on Arawak Radio, right? How are you doing? I'm good. I'm good. Queen Atara now. I'm not Atara anymore. I changed my name to Queen Atara. And I we're doing this interview to talk about this show, this song that me and Barry Vodka did. It's called Rage. He's originally a Ghanaian. And we did a bad song together. And I just wanted to share it with you guys in UK. No. Uh, what, what else should I say? <laughs> DJ Ken. <laughs> I think that's the time. Berry Vodka, tell the people who you are and a little bit about yourself. So I'm Berry Vodka from Ghana. And I do hip hop and rap music. So um, me and Atara we linked up um, some time ago. Wanted to bring out this massive track called Rage. So um, it was fine. It was fine from the beginning. We just... We just we just couldn't wait to begin work, so um, we started work, um, I think, two weeks ago, yeah. before the um, official release. I brought the um, brother instrumental for the song, and I worked on it here on Ga- in Ghana, and she also did a part in Austria. Okay, okay. Um, and when I was done with mine, I, I linked her up, and when she was done, she did the same, and then we, we, um, I, um, we just vibe with it, and so um, we just created a beautiful piece at the end of the day. Yes. It was what we expected. And I, and I was like, Barry, don't destroy me on the beat, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so tell us about this song. Tell us about this song, Rage. What was the concept behind it? Do you want to go first, Barry? <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. Rage, Rage is, Rage is um, a beautiful hip hop song full of energy. And just like the word Rage goes, um, we just put in on everything that we've got everything Rage, everything hot, everything energetic, and everything that we've got. So, um, from the beats to the instrumentals to the lyrics and everything, if you listen from the beginning to end, you know it's energy packed. We we're ready for it, so um, everybody give the instrumental our uh, best shot. And yeah, yeah, me. that's rage. Okay, okay. And what about yourself, uh, Queen Atara? What are you saying about rage? <laughs> she called me Queen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, for rage, it was like an angry song, you know? Like, like I'm telling the people that, uh, like. It was like an angry song, just telling my mind, talking my mind, how I feel. You know? Yeah. And they're just fun. Did you hear his spotless part? Oh my God. You know, there's an artist in Ghana called Shatawali. And do you, do you know him, DJ Cat? Yeah, I've heard of him a few times. Yeah, yeah. And you know, he does Jamaican dancehall music, yeah? Yeah. And when I heard Barry. When I heard Barry did his dance, um, Jamaican slang in the rich song, I was like, he had, he just terminated Shata Wally Stone Boy, all of them in one. Oh, oh that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, he sounded like, like a real Jamaican. I was like, is he sure he's a Ghanaian? <laughs> he sounded like. He sounded like a real Jamaican now. <laughs> anyway, anyway, big up, big up the man, brother. Um, um, rage, rage, rage. When um, I took my pen and paper and I decided to jot down the lyrics, it was like I, I, I was so much into the song that I just wanted to do everything and anything at all yeah. on the song. So, um. I went, I went, I started with the English vibe, and I'm like, yo, now nah, let me, let me add a little bit of Jamaican vibe, but then I'm like, what am I going to do on this track? So, um, I just relaxed a bit, came back to the beat again, and that was it, it was, it was just magical. It's a moment I would never forget in my music life. For real, for real. 
And so when you guys were coming up with the concept and looking at the ideas for the show, how did you decide what you were going to put in there? I wrote it. I wrote my part and I gave it to Barry. And he wrote his magical part and did his thing. Yeah. Uh, he has a naturally stronger voice than me, so I was like, ah, he's going to dominate me on the song. <laughs> but we, we both did well. And you know, when you guys when you guys are collaborating and you're working together, what's the hardest thing about collaborating? We didn't really have any issue. Oh, okay. Yeah, the, the only issue we had is um, I, I was in Ghana and she was in Austria, so... Yeah, it would be good to shoot the video, yeah. Yeah, for real. Yeah, so... 100%, 100%. And you know, there's lots of young people that listen listening to the show. What would you say to them as open coming pe- artists? I would like to say to every young artist, up and coming artist of others, that never lose your focus. Yeah. Stay focused 100%. Never lose your focus. Because the moment you get distracted, you're never going to make it. And, and it looks easy on the eyes, but it's very difficult when it's waiting to music. So never lose your focus. Stay focused 100%. And definitely, you don't get there. 100%, 100%. And what, what are you saying about that, Atara? What would you say for young people out there? My advice, my advice is for young people that want to start doing music, a lot of people that are in the music industry will take advantage of us. When you are upcoming and you are new, you don't know much. I would advise them to read more about the music industry and invest in their shelves rather than to go to other people for help because other people will take advantage of them as new coming artists, talking from experience. Yeah, 100%, 100%. And so, of course, I'm going to ask you guys, would you be up for singing a little bit of the actual song itself? Hey, Barry has to go first. Why, why, why do I have to go first, Sarah? Because I really wanted to hear the Jamaican song. You got to drop it. I saw I drop it. You were the first to go on the beat, so um, ladies first. Let me be a gentleman, so ladies first. You see how he threw me under the bus, DJ Cat? I know. I like my, the second verse more, though. I really okay. like my second verse. Okay, I said, they call me a genius because I like the rhymes. They call me a Spanish man because I did the time. So I read this book so I can uncover lies. They threw away the books to keep you blind, blind. So trying to make me out of who you want me to be. I'm black and sexy and I'll always be the queen. You see my jeans, not in my dreams. Can't find a girl like me. I'm full of self-love and my melanin stings her. First of all, I don't need your pity. I'm a black queen, mother, black woman's been in it, win it. I'm a narcissist because of the lily. I'm a cutie with this rage. Let's be starting to finish. Hey! Mm. <laughs> yeah. You're going out there. Um, okay, so um, my voice is a little bit husky because I had to perform this tonight and record at the same time. But anyway, let's do this. Um, it goes like, finish you is easy. Just like ABC, scene. Show my nigga see me. We take over the scene. I'm a sort of Faji. Niggas trying to be me. Can I go to a Tazi? Y'all can never be me. You don't want this. Me and you don't want this. When I'm done, you can't get free. Smoke that piece and boom that wrist. Oh, yeah, you don't want this. Me and Rich, you don't want this. When I'm done, you can't get free. Smoke that piece and boom that wrist. Man, I'm bad, man, every day. We have to clap it any day. When we start it, we don't end it. Take that block at the end of We have to shut it any day. <laughs> Because of my voice, but I tried anyway. Okay, I love it anyway. Yeah, man, definitely. Yeah. Pure energy, pure vibes. You know what, guys? Where can people get this tune from? Where is it at? It's on every streaming platform. Uh, um, Amazon. Make sure they go and buy it. And, and streaming is important, but they should buy it so that me and Barry can make some money off our music. <laughs> and, and, uh, and, uh, play, um, every streaming platform actually. TikTok, 
tell them to go and make TikTok videos with the Rage song in UK. I would like to see some UK people, even you, DJ Cat. Send me a video. <laughs> yeah, and right now I'm trying to get the um, Rage song on the Billboard chart in the USA, so watch out. Okay, I'm looking forward to that. And of course, what would you guys like to say to the listeners and the fans out there here in the UK and across the world? What would you like to say? Instagram. He's a very good rapper. Give him some more collab, some more international collabs. He's a very good artist. Everybody already knows me. (laughs) (laughs) What are you saying, Barry? um, um, Yeah, big up everybody in UK listening to us right now. Respect, y'all. My name is Barry Voto. Um, You can check me out on YouTube. Yeah, it's, it's very hot to check me out. I've listened to some music over there. Right now, my current single is the one I just did with Atara called Rage. It's full of energy. I know you can, you gonna love it. So, um, everybody go check it out on all streaming platforms. Bless up. Bless up, bless up. And Barry Vodka did a song called Ofegana. Go and check it out. It's my favorite song from him. It's why I chose to do the color with him from that music. Yeah. Okay. Go and check it out. Nice, nice. I like, I like that still. So, of course, we're coming to the end of the interview, and I wanted to say blessing to you both. And, I'm, and you know, this tune is a firecracker, so I'm going to be playing it a lot. Can you send the video? I will do. I'll send it. Yeah, man, anytime. Yeah. Make sure you have a blessed rest of the day, yeah? Yeah, thank you, DJ K, for having us anytime. on your show. Anytime. Always appreciate it. More love, yeah? Bless up. Bless up. Bless up.